Hello and a warm welcome to the Tamil Nadu Brief. I'm Sam Daniel. The headlines first. Tamil Nadu Chief Minister M.K. Stalin tacitly responds to active Vijay's criticism, says even newly launched parties want the DMK eradicated. A housemaid in Chennai tortured and killed by the family that employed her. Second such housemaid murder case in less than two months. Six arrested in Chennai. And Chennai's cake mixing ceremony brings early Christmas cheer. Chief Minister M.K. Stalin today tacitly responded to active Vijay's criticism, saying even newly launched parties want the DMK eradicated. This comes a week after active Vijay at his conference in Virupuram had taken on the DMK tacitly, saying it's corrupt and is misleading the people with its Dravidian model government. Yesterday, Vijay's party, the TVK's executive, in its resolutions had taken on the ruling DMK directly on issues of law and order besides sale of liquor by government-owned liquor shops. Vijay, who has a cult following, would make his electoral debut in 2026 assembly elections in Tamil Nadu, in a state where the two Dravidian parties largely dominate. Although the ruling DMK appears to be unperturbed, the recent elevation of Udainidhi Stalin as the Deputy Chief Minister, many in the party say, is a clear strategy by the Dravidian party to take on Vijay's popularity. Udainidhi himself is an actor-turned-politician as well. After MGR and Jai Lalitha, Tamil Nadu has not seen any popular star successful enough to become chief ministers over the last few decades, including actors like Sivaji Ganesan, Vijay Ganth, Sarat Kumar and even Kamal Hassan. Superstar Rajnikanth too had to opt out. But Vijay's fans are supremely confident that Vijay, making his political plunge at the peak of his acting career, would be able to change the political landscape in Tamil Nadu and make a big splash. And this is what M.K. Stalin had to say today. A disturbing news from Chennai. A 15-year-old minor girl working as a housemaid was assaulted, tortured and killed allegedly by the family who had employed her, all because she did not do her work properly. The couple and four others have been arrested. Police have slapped a case of murder besides invoking the Protection of Children from Sexual Offences Act, POCSO. Investigators say the couple had allegedly tortured the minor girl using a hot iron and cigarette butts. This is the second such murder of a housemaid in the last two months. Just last week, police had arrested a couple in Bengaluru for allegedly killing the housemaid and dumping her body packed in a suitcase near Salem, raising several questions on the safety of housemaids. And finally, the traditional cake mixing ceremony has brought Christmas cheer quite early in Chennai. Chef uh, Janu Lambert, thank you very much for your time. What's the st story behind this tradition? Okay, the story behind it is uh, like uh, the British people when they were having, this is the time where their uh, uh, harvest season is over and entering into the winter season. So during that season, as a community to improve the uh, gathering, they call everyone and then they put all the fruits into the alcohol 
and store it and preserve it for the winter season so that they can make a wonderful uh, Christmas cakes. Nina, I'm going to ask you the same question again. What's the story behind this? For me, it's all about communities coming together. It's about people coming together to celebrate Christmas, which is like a universal festival for everyone. So this is like a tradition at Savera also. So we make sure that people are connected from all walks of life who love Savera are here this special day so that they mix up their love with the cake. That's what it is, Sam. And 200 kilos of ingredient. This will turn into how much of cake? That be going into the three times higher, so 600 kilograms. And uh, interestingly, every year we are keep on increasing the fruits. The demand for our Savera recipe, because being a 56 years old hotel, the recipes what we follow is a very traditional and by the scratch. So every year we are keep on increasing the fruits because of the demand. And why liquor is being mixed or added? Okay, the main reason to add the liquor into it is to get the flavor and aroma. And if you say after baking, is it being uh, kids free? Definitely we can have it because during baking and during all this season, uh, the maturing time, all the alcohol goes evaporated. And cake during Christmas and New Year season is also big business. It is, it is. And thanks to everyone's efforts and of course the taste that uh, the chefs put into it, I think it's going to be a hot selling cake. But that's all the time we have for on this edition of the Tamil Nadu Brief. Hope you liked it. Join us tomorrow, same time. Goodbye.